Welcome to Analysis Prime University. My name is Michael Quinn, and I am a Senior Analytics Training Consultant with Analysis Prime University. In this tutorial, you will learn how to correct any data quality issues using the Create Transform function, how to validate the full data set, and how to create a model from the cleansed imported data source file. During the data import, it was identified that you have one issue under the model requirements. Expand the model requirements issue. And now you can see that your mapping was fine. So mapping is complete. And there were no issues identified with calculation. However, under the model requirements data quality, you can see that it says the following columns contain data quality issues. If I click on date, it will now highlight the issues that have been identified. One of the issues that we want to correct is the date format. Currently, it is set for day, month, and year, and our data is set for month, day, and year. So we will go to the drop down and we will select month, day, and year to correct that format. And then you can see based on that that we have two errors still. One is uh, a, an invalid date format that is blank. So we can just click on that. And then we will want to replace it and you can replace that from the panel here on the right hand side or up in the, the logic box. Select replace and then between the quotation marks in value we're going to replace it with an acceptable date. And then hit enter. You see that has been corrected and now we have one other issue that is highlighted. And so we are going to also correct that issue. And we are going to replace that one as well. Once we've got that corrected, go ahead and hit enter. And that's how you use the create a transform function to correct your data. We will also want to then validate our full data set. So at the bottom of the panel, we will select validate data. We got the sign that said that the validation is complete and there are no other issues identified. So now we can go ahead and select create model. And you'll get a pop up just asking to make sure that you have finished mapping and editing your data. Because once we create the model, then we will have it set up. Select create. And go ahead and name your model accordingly. While your model is being created, you'll get the pop up that says that it is in progress. And then once it has been completed, you will get a pop-up or a confirmation that your model has been successfully created. And you can see under the import jobs, the date and time that the import was created. In this tutorial, you learned how to correct any data quality issues using the create transform function, how to validate the full data set and then finally, how to create a model from the cleansed imported data source file. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this tutorial, click the like button below.
You can also view our growing catalog of self-paced courses, tutorials, webinars, and join the community forum by creating your free account at analysisprimeuniversity.com.